Robert Preston. It's nice to have you here. Hello, Ellen. How are you tonight? Good, good. And how are you, Carol Burnett? That's fine, dear. How are you? Golly, I'm glad to have you back. It's good to be back. And speaking of being back, I understand you're going to go back on our friend Gary Moore's show. Yes, I'll be on uh, uh, the 20th. 8th of this month. 28th of January, back yeah. in the Gary Moore Show, Can't Carol wait. Burnett. Watch our favorite show with Carol Burnett that night. Thank you. And speaking of favorite shows, you worked with this man before, haven't you? Yes. <laughs> you did a special with him. Yes, and it was, I think, one of the most enjoyable shows I ever did in my whole life. I love it. <laughs> I've got news for you. They tell me at CBS that this summer we're going to get to see it again, right? I'm thrilled. I'm thrilled about it. They're going to rerun it, and I think we'll all be looking forward to it with even more excitement than we did the first time. Thank you. Your first partner is Gary Justice. Gary, are you married? Yes, I am. Well, that's good. I like a <laughs> nice short. <laughs> they usually say, yes, I am. I've got 19 children or something like that. But he just says, yes, I am. That's nice. I'm going to follow you tonight, Bob. Right down to the Lyceum Theater to see you in uh, Nobody Loves an Albatross. Oh, I'll try to see all the words, Alan. Welcome there. <laughs> it's a big hit. Yes, it is. And uh, once again, having gotten over that terrible, terrible thing that you have to go through when uh, you wonder whether you're a hit or a miss, because that's what the theaters become these days. Either you're a big hit or you don't go. I'd like to tell the wonderful American audience that shows are closing every week that you should go see. We're getting our share of people right now. I can afford to be a little generous. If they close too soon for you, come see us. But please go see the theater so we can be around with you for a while. Amen. Amen. Too many very kind shows have closed too soon this year, and too many people have missed good shows. Ruth Jackson, are you a working girl? Yes, I am, Alan. I'm a fifth grade teacher, and I have 27 students. You're a teacher. Yes. Glad to have a teacher. 27 students. Yes. Well, good. What you... am I doing with it? <laughs> All right. You've got good partners. Let's play password. It's a game of word communication where you try to make your partner say the password using one-word clues, as you very well know. <sighs> Carol Burnett, Robert Preston, our friends at home. The password is shower. All right, first clue is yours. See if you can get Gary to say it for 10 points, Carol. April... Shower. Wow! Well, Joe Hamilton, you can't beat that. That's pretty good. She just scored 10 points in the first clue toward a 25-point game. Winner has $250 and the chance to win even that much more in the lightning round. All right, Ruth, you and Gary have the words this time. As they look at it, we'd like you to see it at home. The password is chalk. Same word, of course. All right, Ruth, start with you 10 points. Blackboard. Chalk. You did it, too. That's very good. By the way, when you hear this sound, <laughs> that means your clue has not been accepted by our authority, who is Dr. Reason A. Goodwin, an editor of the World Book Encyclopedia Dictionary. Ten to ten. All right. Let's see if this will get you. Carol Burnett, Robert Preston, I want you to see it. The password is dungeon. All right. See if you can do this on ten, Carol. <laughs> Torture. Torment. Torture. Torment. No. Nine points, Bob. Jail. Prisoner. Prisoner. No. Eight points, Carol. Um, chamber. Cell. Cell. Mm. No. <laughs> <laughs> Seven points, Bob. Dank. Ooh. Dang. Five seconds, Goop. Hurt. No. Six points, Carol. Below. Dungeon. Dungeon. Yeah. That's Dungeon. Good <laughs> Sixteen to ten. Sixteen to ten. All right. Ruth, you have the word. You may win on your first chance this time, Gary. As they look at it, we'd like you to see it. The password is drunk. All right, Ruth, 10 points. Ossified. Drunk. <laughs> 20 to 16. Either team can win. Carol's got to do it on her first time out. Carol, Bob, friends. The password is symphony. All right, Carol, 10 points. You can do it. You can win on this. Philharmonic. Orchestra. No, I goofed. Uh, all right. Nine points to give you the game, Bob. Beethoven's... Symphony. Symphony. <laughs> I got you. All right, Robert, your first time out, you won a game. 
Ruth has I can never beat that girl. <laughs> $250 for Ruth, a chance to pick up that much more in the lightning round. The trick here, as you know, is to do it in one minute. Here's the first word, go. Carpet. Rug. 50. King. Queen. 100. Ice. Snow. Melted. Sleet. Uh, <laughs> liquid. Slush. Clear. Water. Good. Sleep. Rest. On. Bed. Head. Pillow. Uh, hmm. Money. Currency. Uh, building. Fund. Savings. Loan. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, Chase. River. Bank. Good. Well, you did pretty well. Look at that. Well, 39 seconds. You did it all. Ruth, you have 250. 250 giving Ruth Jackson $500. Gary Justice, you have $50. And thank you both for a fine game of passwords. Good luck, you guys. Yeah.